If I asked you to name the fastest animal on Earth, what would your answer be? Cheetah for sure, right? After all, that's what we were taught in elementary school, and we, being innocent kids, believed it without thinking twice. But how credible was that information? Or was it credible at all? Let's find out together. Cheetah is one graceful wildcat that can run 20 to 25 feet in one long stride. Their flexing spine, lightweight body, and giant leg muscles play a vital role in helping them reach the speed of 109.4 kilometers per hour. In the year 2012, a cheetah named Sarah became the fastest cheetah on Earth when she covered a distance of 100 meters in just 5.95 seconds. Now that is impressive, and proves that no land animal runs as fast as a cheetah. But here's the catch. The speed of cheetahs recorded in ideal test conditions isn't what they normally use to catch their prey. In the wild, this ferocious predator usually runs at an average speed of 64 kilometers per hour, that too for a few seconds only. Determining the fastest creature on this planet is far more complex than we can comprehend. From animals on land to fish in the ocean, several creatures are known for their extraordinary speed. One of those creatures is a large-billed fish living in tropical and temperate waters of the Atlantic Ocean, the sailfish. This dangerously fast predator can swim at the speed of 112 kilometers per hour. They accomplish this incredible speed while leaping, and that is why they've earned the title of the fastest leapers. Along with its extraordinary speed, nature has given the sailfish eyes that assist them to process images at race car speed and precision. But here's something about this great ocean predator which confirms that it isn't the fastest animal in the world. Sailfish don't swim at that speed all the time. A study reveals that in normal circumstances, an average sailfish swims through the ocean at a speed of just half that. Meh. Disappointed? Who knew sailfish is true to its name and likes to sail slowly like a ship? Talking about ocean animals, let's look at a carnivorous crustacean whose incredible speed has taken scientists by surprise. The Mantis Shrimp This animal does not have powerful muscles like a tiger. Neither is it a great leaper like sailfish. Mantis shrimp has a unique club instead, which it uses to attack its prey. Though it's small, its punch is packed with such force that it cracks open the shell of the prey into tiny pieces. When Patek and her colleagues began researching mantis shrimp, they found it hard to comprehend how it snagged its meal. Its club-like mouth part would come out so quickly that it was impossible to see the movement with naked eyes. After 12 years of research and some high-end cameras, Paddock finally succeeded in studying its speed and acceleration. They figured out that the mantis shrimp attacks its prey with a speed of 83 kilometers per hour, an acceleration that is like that of a 22 caliber bullet. Imagine if all shrimps were that fast. We would have been deprived of such delicious meat. Sounds horrible to me at least. Anyway, since this video isn't about how good shrimp tastes, let's get back to the real topic. Mantis shrimp might have an incredible strike rate, but it cannot overshadow that of frogfish. This underwater sea creeper swims at a slow speed. In fact, it doesn't even like to move from its place. But that doesn't stop it from having its favorite fish's dinner. All thanks to its impressive bite rate. The speed of a frogfish's bite results from the vacuum it creates in its mouth. A vacuum is so efficient that it sucks the nearby prey in just milliseconds. That means that this lazy fish takes just one thousandth part of a second to get its food, which is surely much less than predators like a cheetah. Besides this, the frogfish is the master in camouflaging. This camouflage helps in protection from predators and also enables them to lure prey. Do you know that many species can change color too? Some of the frogfish species are covered with other organisms, such as algae or hydrosa, which makes it difficult for the prey to spot them. Keeping this camouflage in mind, frogfishes generally move slow, lying in wait for the prey, and then strike extremely rapidly. I guess it's safe to say that frogfish is a couch potato with perks. Only if we could also get our food this way. But sea animals aren't the only ones with fast and powerful strikes. Central and Southern America houses an insect that has an unbelievable strike rate. We're talking about none other than the trap jaw ant. Just like its name shows, 
It has a set of jaws that help it catch its prey at an incredible speed. To be more precise, a trap jaw ant can snap its mandibles at the rate of 115 to 207 feet per second. That means that this incredible insect can bite someone 2300 times in just one blink of our eye. But those mandibles aren't there to catch the prey only. They help the trap jaw ant in escaping the predators. When in danger, the trap jaw ant uses all its energy to evade the predators. The ant closes its jaw and then uses it to push itself off the ground. With just one snap of its jaws, this marvelous creature is in the air, covering a distance of 3.3 inches. The movement is so swift that human beings could not make it out for years until the discovery of high-quality video cameras. Trap jaw ants may be dominant predators with incredible speed, but the creature it loves to feast on isn't easy to catch. That is the termite. Just like trap jaw ants, termites have extremely powerful mandibles. They snap these mandibles on the ground to jump away from their predator. Sometimes, termites even snap at ants to push them away, and in the worst case scenario, to kill them. Scientists conducted several experiments to figure out which instinct out of the two has better snapping speed, and the results were shocking. Mandibles of the termite soldiers were similar to or even more rapid than that of the snap jaw ants. Scientists discovered that the peak snapping velocity of the termites is 134 meters per second. Hence, it breaks the record once held by trap jaw ant. Imagine having to catch prey faster than you. Whew, that sounds like a tough job. Just like termites, there is another animal that gives its predators a tough time. That is the Mexican free-tailed bat. Its long wings and aerodynamic body make it clear that nature built them to fly at high speed. But exactly how fast does this bat fly? To figure this out, researchers temporarily attached transmitters to the Mexican free-tailed bats and began their investigation. The scientists discover that these mammals routinely fly at the speed of a and astonishingly, they create this solely with their wings. But why do they fly that fast? Maybe these super-fast bats help Batman catch the villains. Who knows? What is that? Backup. What the? But is there any animal that can beat the fastest animal on Earth? The answer is yes. It's none other than the Mexican free-tailed bat's greatest predator, the peregrine falcon. A winged beast that is undoubtedly the fastest bird and the absolute speed champion. It normally flies at the speed of 40 to 60 miles per hour. When hunting, it flaps its wings up to four times per second and attains the speed of 220 miles per hour. The rate is astounding considering that other birds can't even breathe at such speed, while the peregrine falcon enjoys its flight effortlessly and captures its prey. Now that we've looked at these speed champions, it's proven that our childhood beliefs of the cheetah being the fastest animal in the world is nothing more than a fable. Some of the tiniest anthropods and bats could beat the cheetah if they were face to face. With that being said, we rest our case. But scientists will probably continue their search for animals even faster. After all, there are billions of creatures in the wilderness, and it will probably take years to find the actual speed champion. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to click the bell icon for more just as amazing videos.